Hey Pisces, it's a guide, the guidance goddess of collective, of the collective, of the collective reading. Um, I'm saving your energy, okay? Um, I, I remember your past when you were going through and you were making good decisions. So I thought I should come back and keep you on the right track. And so um, I'm going to do a different type of subject across the thread. But it's something similar, okay? All right, Holy Spirit, angels, and ancestors, what would you like me to channel to the Pisces Collective of Soul Tribe? Things might have went backwards. You're working on them to go forward. Times is hard. I mean, some Pisces is having financial issues. <clears throat> Let's see what the court say. That's most I got. Y'all wanna watch me shuffle the court? That's most I got. Ancestors, Pisces Collective, Soul Tribe, YouTube, this, this spirits only. I welcome you in. I ask God if you can protect the Pisces family, Pisces, and the Pisces family, as well as my family and me. And I pray that I'm able to heal and um, God, whoever is in the need of this reading, okay? All right, let's shuffle for the Pisces Collective Soul Tribe YouTube. All right. Pisces, what's going on? It's the goddess goddess. Oh, my goodness, I feel bad. But y'all know who I am. I'm the goddess goddess. I'm here to keep it real and help you heal, okay? I'm here for you. For you. I'm your friend. I don't know you at all. So some things in here you might want to, it might be a warning or it might be motivation, okay? And I expect you to take heat. That's why I do this, okay? So I can help you overcome obstacles and challenges and heal properly, okay? So Pisces Collective, so trapped. Pisces Collective, what is your... Heart of the matter, okay? Let's put this up here. What is the heart of the matter, okay? For Pisces Collective, okay? What is happening in the present moment for the Pisces Collective? So Celebrations, friendships, or maybe this could be a third party, three three people, someone stepping out of love. Let's clarify the story of cups. Clarify the story of cups. Yeah, someone hurts you by going out and having a third party and I heard mistress and this deeply, deeply hurts you. And this is a ten of swords. It was the last sword. Why did this person hurt you with this third party? Why did this person hurt you? Pisces feel like it's so too. Because it came out because it was justice. Okay, things was needing to be balanced out in the situation. Someone was having a third party, either you or another, okay? That deeply, deeply hurt you, okay? I'm hurt. It hurt you, not only the other person that was involved. So with this sword, he's, he's, he's asking for judgment and he's asking for these scales to be balanced out, okay? So God is looking at everything and he sees everything and um, he's trying to get you prepared to come home. He's on his way, so we need to do right towards people. What we give is what we get in life, period. All right, so I wanna tell you the challenges you are facing up against this situation, Pisces Melissa. What's the Pisces Collective challenge? Oh, that's a lot of cards, but I'm going to read them. First of all, I see a tower moment. 
okay? Challenges you are facing is a destructive moment, something you don't see coming, something that you did not want to happen, something that could change your life forever. Also, we have a cord up under here. And it is the world court and the hermit court. So you are actually going to have a new beginning or a new start of being yourself. You have done some soul searching and healing and praying and meditating and seeing, talking to God and seeing exactly what's wrong with you and how can you be your authentic self. And materialistic things does not matter, my Pisces, okay? A tower moment came with that where you so searching, you seeing that this is causing you anxiety and depression and losing sleep, okay? This is causing you to be up all night. You like to sleep, Pisces, and you're not getting any sleeps from all those swords that have hurt you. This is the nine of swords, and this is the ten of swords. So this comes with completion, okay? Okay, God told you to leave a particular situation alone. Instead, you continue to go on against his will. So with justice, he creates a tower moment for you to understand that that's not the right way for you to go, okay? Also, you were still stuck. You just blindfolded mentally, okay? You didn't know which way to go, and all you had to do was take, like I said, it was mentally. Take that blindfold off, remove her through those sores, unrope yourself, and come to clarity on what you really want, okay? You're having strength, okay? And God is asking you to, to keep working harder. Keep working harder on your pinnacles, being strength, as she tames the lion, a Leo could be specific, specifically, specifically in your life right now, okay? You are the queen and that's the lion and no matter what, you have control. So it's time to have strength, okay? Because you knew that this particular thing was going to happen with this queen of pentacles, okay? You asked this person to come in, okay? And tell you the truth, even though you knew the truth. You wanted them to be able to come in and tell you the truth, okay? And they're coming in. Someone's coming in. It's either you going in to them to find out the truth, or they coming in, but it looks like you're going in to them to find the truth, okay? Which is leaving you indecisive in having a new perspective, okay? You have your blindfolds on again. You have your heart covered. You don't know which really way to take. Okay, but you have a new perspective on the way that you want to do things, Pisces. And um, that's not a bad thing at all. You know, you've been hurt so much. It's time to have a new world. Let this disaster, let this traumatizing tower create something beautiful, Pisces. If you have not yet liked, sap, subscribe to my channel. Join the So Trap member uh family and um get clear accurate messages every time like it will resonate with you in some way and if it does not leave the rest behind for another pisces okay what is your spiritual lesson what are you supposed to learn from this pisces collective okay you are the moon court you are the moon court and the hat priest this is for you to know exactly who you are what you're worth, what your standards are, what you will tolerate with, what you want best, what makes you happy, okay? That is your spiritual challenge to understand more about yourself, okay? During this hurt, hurtful moment in your life, you know, sometimes we gotta start search and figure out who are we? Why do we allow to be done like this? Do we know our worth? Ask yourself that. Do you know your worth, Pisces? I love you. I'm going to heal you. I'm going to keep it real and I'm going to help you heal. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead and subscribe. If you feeling my energy. All right, so now we're going to go with what's going on with the present situation for the Pisces Collective. Presently, 
You are being your authentic self. You are healing. Okay? Maybe you want to heal things with a page of wands. Okay? In the present, you want to heal things. Maybe this is a child. Okay? And um, you want to be your authentic self with this child. Okay? You want to show this child that you want to heal. You're showing this child that you're healing. And this person, our leader, our Sagittarius, is focused on their wand. Okay? They might be a younger energy, but you, Aquarius, could be involved. But you want things to be even with this particular energy, this page of wands. What's going on with the future, Holy Spirit? That's a Pisces collective, so I have you to. Your future is getting a page. I mean, I, I said getting a page. Someone is sending a message because they feel abandoned and they feel left out, okay? They feel left out and they feel abandoned and they got a message and they walked away, okay? Yeah. It was a message. It literally, for the present, for the uh, present, the future moment, there was a message that left this particular energy, which is Pisces, it could be you, left you abandoned, which had you walk away with the Eight of Cups. Leave it alone. Let go and let God. You know, sometimes you can't handle but what you can handle. And it's okay because God's been telling you to go a certain way and we need to start listening to God and having faith. Period. Pray pray about it. If you don't know which way, pray about it. Not making the decision is making the decision on its own. Remember that. What is your attitude about this? Pisces, Colossus, so trap. Oh yeah. You're broken by this. Your heart is broken, okay? Your heart is broken about this King of Cups. This King of Cups is a Pisces, a Cancer, or a... Who else is water? Cancer or a Scorpio. That has broke your heart. Why did they break your heart? Holy Spirit, angels, and ancestors. Clarify why this King of Cups broke. It made you meditate. It made you meditate, it made you pray, have conflicted thoughts, about a new opportunity. You started to be courageous because you started to heal. You know that at this Ten of Swords that you got at first, this Ten of Swords was actually Ten of Swords. At the bottom you see Ten of Swords. But this Ten of Swords is everything is fine. Okay, because you know what's going on. You wasn't blinded to it. You was the queen of swords. You knew this was happening the whole time. Maybe you stepped out because this was happening the whole time behind your back. Somebody was stabbing you in your back. This leads you to meditate, to pray, to ask God for answers so you won't get hurt any longer, okay? Leaving you with conflicted thoughts, okay? Not knowing who to trust, having sores and looking behind you. And and it was a new opportunity, and you wanted this new opportunity. And you have a conflicted thoughts about this new opportunity, okay? And you're, you're being courageous and, and, and determined. And, and Pisces, honestly, you can do it. You can do it. Let me find out. You let them come for you. You put in the work, and then they do you like that. And then again, there's some Pisces that did someone else like it. Karma, the, karma come good and karma come bad. We need to do better. <clears throat> but <clears throat> how does this influence others? This is an early of Sagittarius. People are focused on your situation. They want to know everything that's going on. They looking. They want to see your next move. Give me more of this King of Wands. Holy Spirit, angels, and ancestors. 
Yeah, they're they're watching social media, seeing what they can find out. Meddling. That's what people do. They meddle. You need to clear your energy. You don't need nobody meddling in your business. You do what you want to do for what you want to do. Your heart tells you to do it. Not what everybody else says. That's why people get caught up and confused and mess up because they don't do what they're supposed to do for self and not for others. Okay? What are your hopes and prayers, Pisces Collective? Your hopes and prayers is to... It could be a hoax and it could be a fur, but you have been burdened to the max. You cannot take no more. You are taking all 10 wands and getting away and taking control of your life with the chariot cord. The chariot cord moves quick, okay? They get up out the way. They know things is not right and they have to leave the situation, okay? Well, what is your outcome? Holy Spirit, angels, and ancestors. Your outcome, you will be going through a transition with the Knight of Pentacles. Give me more on this transition. Yeah, because people have deceived you, lied to you, cheated to you, manipulated you. Okay? They really did. This person that came in with all this love. Okay? Or maybe I see you, maybe you lied and manipulated and cheated them. Okay? Regardless of the fact of who did it, Here's a death court, a Scorpio court. Everyone involved is going to have a renewal, a rebirth to their life to do better. Things is going to come out the closet. It's judgment time. God is coming back. So he's letting, letting people letting people be seen for what they are. Yeah, okay. And bottom of the deck is... This is his could be do. This could be doing some with the merge, okay? This is you, and I see you waiting on your ships to come in, okay? Waiting on your new beginning, okay? And you are being patient, okay? Because you no longer want to deal with that particular situation any longer, okay? This home situation, this merge, I'm hearing, okay? You are the queen of cups. You are beautiful. You are elegant. You you have a lot of emotions. You've been hurt a whole lot. Like, and you don't know how to give your love. So you're just going to wait on love to come in. And guess what? You will have a new beginning, a creative opportunity coming your way. Okay? So don't worry. Do not worry. Because you have to get the through this transition and its renewal and its rebirth to for people to put more respect on your name, I'm hearing. Don't ever let people treat you like, like you're not deserving. You're deserving. And you don't treat people like they're not deserving. Because what goes around comes around. And you will be miserable. If you don't want to be with a person, you tell a person you don't want to be with a person and you leave them alone. And you will not catch bad karma. And I got more for you, okay? I got my my old Lord Oracle course and see what they say. But if you have not liked, if you got any motivation, inspiration, encouragement, out of my video today, I would love for you to subscribe. Motiv uh, I said motivate. Motivate people, but subscribe. Subscribe to my channel. Drop a comment, like. Let me know how you feel about me and the spreads. Okay, so this is for the Pisces Collective Last Shuffle. For the Soul Tribe Collective. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Ask the Most High God, Jesus Christ, angels and ancestors. Let's get clear, active messages for the Pisces Collective. In Jesus' name, I pray. For the Pisces Collective Soul Tribe, you too. Yes. If you want to book a personal reading, make sure you just drop a comment. It says flirt. Extend your lighthearted energy to others. However, that may resonate, resonate with you. If it does not resonate, leave it for another Pisces. Chemistry. There's a strong magnetic attraction here. So maybe you have a strong magnetic chemistry with a particular person, you know? Um, sometimes that doesn't have to do with lovers. Sometimes that has to do with family, um, you know, someone that you have chemistry with. 
with flirt and chemistry. It sounds like a lover. And it says, it is safe for you to love, open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. So we was talking about the same particular lover, okay? It's safe for you to love, amen? And bottom of the deck, getting to know each other. So I don't know if this is new or if it's old energy, our reconciliation, our brand new beginning. But it says, as you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Okay? I am the guidance goddess of unique readings in tarot. If you got any inspiration and motivation and encouragement, like my video. Okay? And if you feel any type of good energy, if you watch who you get your spiritual advice, if, if, advice from and guidance because I have a pure heart. I love all and um, I praise the most high God Jesus Christ. So if you're a man feels good, you know what? Subscribe. You know what I'm saying? It's a new movement. I love you so much, Pisces, my water fish. I like that so extra. But I do. I love y'all. You know what I'm saying? Uh, things you are going through a transition. You're going through a reading birth. You've been hurt. So just bear with it. And if it gets hard, what I need you to do is pray. And when you pray, what do you do? Have faith in Jesus' name. I pray. Don't pray if you ain't gonna have faith. It's the sad work. Have a good day. I see you the rest of your good morning for real. And I see you next reading. Bye bye.